Hi, uh, my name is Mitchell Ferros. I'm the CEO of Aligo. We crowdsource feedback and provide insights to users and companies using our app. Uh, I'm really excited to share with you our journey today. At the very beginning, when I first had the idea for the app, it was all in my head and I didn't even know quite what I wanted. Uh, I kind of knew I was like, I, I, I needs to feel like Instagram, <laughs> you know, it's a, that's all I can tell you. We knew in our heads what we were trying to do and we knew where we wanted to be and we had no idea what the path looked like to get there. That's what the Genesis framework did for us. It was at each step, this is what, this is the question we need to answer. And this is the question we need to ask ourselves. How are we going to solve this? Um, who are we going to target for this? What will that look like? And then you move on to the next step. And at each point you have, you validate what you're doing. And you validate each step you're taking so that you're not going to incur those mistakes and the costs of just racing into it. You're jumping from step one to step four missing two and three and then at step four you have to come back to step one to go to step two it's just time and money one of the biggest benefits that i've found with especially with working with genesis is you've been here and done this before and we haven't and we had a lot of assumptions and coming into this we kind of assumed you you start and you finish and that's it and that's not how, how it works. There's a lot of steps along the way. So using the framework and having, it, it's, it's kind of like you, we had someone who's, who's been down this journey before to just keep us on the right path. It's like we, we kind of knew where we wanted to go, but we didn't have the path to get there. And the framework, the, the iteration, the testing, you know, working with, working with the team in the development in what it's gonna look like, even even with the business and the business side of things validating the idea and all that kind of stuff that that was massive that that was it was make or break like we wouldn't have the app on the app store if we didn't have this model that we could follow in the system we we you don't you don't know that as an entrepreneur you're you're kind of going into everything a little bit blind if you haven't done it before we hadn't done it before so we had no experience to call upon Genesis were able to turn my idea or the dot points that were in my head into an actual thing that I can look at and go, oh, that's exactly what I want. You, you look at the Genesis framework and you say to yourself, okay, they've walked this path before, we can do this. So then you jump into that and there's, there's challenges along the way, of course, but again, it was always do what you need to do every day. You had one eye on the horizon that you've never seen before, but you're just hoping you're gonna get there. And it was still, it didn't seem real that, you know, we're going to, we're gonna be here and this is what it's gonna look like. Then you get, you get the app and you just think, wow, like it's, I just, I did this and I got here, I never expected to do this. I never expected to be here. I never expected to have an app on the app store. One phone call, that changed everything. One phone call, let's set up a meeting. We came in and sat in here for like an hour and you know, we said, all right, like, let's, let's see what we can do.